All right, good morning, second grade. Today for social studies, we are going to be looking at the Empire State Building. So people come from all over the world to see the Empire State Building. You can see all of New York City from the top of this skyscraper. Fighting to be tallest, the race was on. Who could build the tallest building in the world? Two friends, John J. Raskob and Alfred E. Smith, thought they could. So in the picture here, it says Raskob at left and Smith stand beside a model of the Empire State Building. The first design for the Empire State Building included a landing area for dirigibles or airships. Raskob and Smith decided to build the Empire State Building in New York City. They hired planners and builders. A man named Walter P. Chrysler had the same idea. He had New York's Chrysler Building built in 1930. It is almost 1,050 feet or 320 meters tall. For less than one year, the Chrysler Building was the tallest building in the world. The following year, the Empire State Building was finished. It opened on May 1, 1931. It was the tallest building in the world. Lots of people gathered for the grand opening of the Empire State Building on May 1, 1931. The famous skyscraper is 1,250 feet or 381 meters tall. Antennas and a lightning rod have been added to the top. They make it 1,454 feet or 443 meters tall. And we see here at the top of the building the antenna and the lightning rod up here. And it says lightning strikes the Empire State Building about 100 times each year. The Empire State Building remained the world's tallest building for more than 40 years. So we see in this picture here on the right, the Empire State Building still towers over most of New York City. Millions of people visit it every year. They travel to the 86th or 102nd floor. They can see the city from observatories there. So we see in the picture some people standing on one of these floors and it says observatories allow people to see far off distances. Steel columns run all the way around the Empire State Building. So next we're going to talk about new inventions. New inventions allowed the Empire State Building to be built. Inventors discovered a way to make steel very quickly. The cost of steel went down. Stronger steel columns and beams were used to support tall skyscrapers. The Empire State Building was one of these. And here on the right we see a worker perches on the end of a giant steel beam. A total of 210 steel columns hold up the Empire State Building. Steel workers put in the columns. They worked high up in the open air. Some had no ropes or nets. And so we see in this photo here, a worker hangs onto a cable high above the ground. Elevators were made safe. People couldn't climb all of the stairs to the 102nd floor of the Empire State Building, but with elevators, people could get there quickly and easily. The Empire State Building grew taller and taller. At one point, workers added one floor almost every day. A new way to build. Workers built the Empire State Building in record time. They finished it in one year and 45 days. They did this by using brand new ideas about building. And so we see in the picture it says, workers rivet a steel beam into place. Parts of the building were made at other places. Trucks brought the parts to the building site. And we see in the picture on the left, a crane picks up building parts from a truck. Small railroad cars inside the building carried supplies to workers. The workers added the pieces to the building's frame. 
And so in the picture on the right, it shows workers pushed railroad cars loaded with supplies over little tracks. Sometimes the building held more than 3,000 workers on the different floors. Workers built many different floors at the same time. Each new floor made a cover for the one below. Workers on top floors placed steel beams. Workers on the lower floors could do other jobs, such as painting. And so uh, in the picture on the right, it shows builders work high above the city streets. A special look. Architect William Lamb planned how the building would be built. The skyscraper is 102 stories tall. It has 6,500 windows. The building does not rise in a straight line. It gets narrower as it rises. The building narrows at the setbacks. A setback is a place where a wall is built back from the edge of a building. And so in the photo on the left, it shows this photo shows some of the Empire State Building's setbacks. On most nights, the top of the Empire State Building is lit up. Different colored lights are used for special holidays. And so in the picture on the right, it shows the Empire State Building is lit up with red and green lights for Christmas. Still standing tall. Several newer buildings are taller than the Empire State Building. It has not been the world's tallest since 1972. But the skyscraper remains one of the world's greatest buildings. So people from all over the world come to see the Empire State Building. It remains one of New York City's most popular places. So on the left, it shows a map of the New York City area. So up here we have a smaller map of the whole state of New York and where New York City is located in the state of New York. And then we have the bigger map that shows a little bit more detail of the New York City area. So we see the Chrysler Building and where that is located. And then we also see where the Empire State Building is located. So some fun facts about the Empire State Building. So the Empire State Building gets its name from a nickname for New York, the Empire State. Planners thought dirigibles could dock at the top of the building, then passengers could unload, but early tests showed this plan was not safe. In July of 1945, an airplane accidentally crashed into the Empire State Building. Fourteen people were killed. The building was damaged, but it was fixed. Every year, there is a race inside the Empire State Building. People run up 1,576 steps to the 86th floor observatory. The record time for reaching the observatory is 9 minutes and 37 seconds. All right, and this concludes our book today for Social Studies on the Empire State Building.